Hi guys, my name is Marty from letsbuildwp.com and today I'm going to show you how to create a drop down menu in WordPress. For those of you who maybe don't know what a drop down menu is, it's literally a menu where you can hover over something and a drop down list will appear and everything in the drop down list is also a clickable link in the menu. So in this example I have an R services page which we can click on and visit or alternatively we can hover over the R services page and click on each service individually. Obviously you might not be using services, you might be using something else, but I'm going to cover how to create a drop down menu in WordPress now. Okay, so in this tutorial I'm going to create a brand new menu which will have the drop down section. As you can see, I don't have a drop down section in my menu at the minute, so I'm going to create a new menu. To do that, we just need to hover over our site title at the top and click Dashboard. Then on the left hand side, just click where it says Appearance, and then under that, click Menus. Now we just need to click where it says Create a new menu at the top, and then give our menu a name. So for this one, I'm just going to call it Drop Down. The name's only for your own reference, so you can type whatever you want in here and no one's going to see it. Once you've given your menu a name, just click here on the right hand side where it says Create Menu. In this example, I want my menu to contain my About page, my Contact page, and my Services page. And then whenever people hover over the Services tab, it's going to have a drop down of my different services. You can add pages categories, posts, custom links, whatever you want to your menu. In this example I'm just going to be using pages. If you do want to add something like posts and it's not appearing here on the left hand side you can just click up at the top where it says screen options and then check the box beside where it says posts and it will appear down here. You can then just click here to expand the boxes to show you the different posts or pages or whatever you have. In this example I'm just using pages. So to add my pages to the menu I just need to check the box beside each of the pages I want to add. So I want to add my about us page, my contact us page, my our services page and then the five different services. Once you've checked the box beside any pages or posts or anything that you want to add to your menu you can just click here where it says add to menu. Then you want to click and drag each of the menu items into order and the order is from top to bottom is left to right on your menu. So if I just left it like this my menu would go service 2 at the start then service 5, service 4, 3, 1 etc. I want my menu to go about us, our services and then contact us. And then whenever you hover over the R services tab, it'll show the five different services. So to do that, I just need to click and drag the first page to the top, which will be the About Us page. So just click on it with your mouse and drag it up to the top. Then I want it to be R services, so I'll do the same again. Click and drag it up to just below About Us. And then the same for the Contact Us page. I'll click and drag it up to just below the R services page. Then I'm going to click and drag my different services in under the R services block in the order that I want them to appear. So I'm going to click and drag service 1 first, then service 2, 3, 4 and 5. Then to make each of the services appear in a drop down format rather than just in the menu as normal we need to click and drag each of the services. I do understand that you might not be using services, you might be using something else but whatever you're wanting to appear in the drop down list you just need to click and drag slightly over to the right and whenever you let go it'll show up and say sub item. So you want to turn each of the items you want to be in the drop down into sub items in the menu. So this now shows that my menu is going to go about us, our services and then contact us. 
Then whenever we hover our mouse over the R services tab, our different sub items will show up in the order that they're in this list. So whenever I hover over the R services tab, the list will show up in this order. Once you're happy with everything, you can just check here where it says primary menu if you're wanting to set this as a primary menu otherwise you can set it to something else I'm setting this as my primary menu so I'll check primary menu and then click save menu and once it's been saved we can just visit our site and we'll see that the new menu is active so there's the about us page the contact us page and then the our services page and when we hover over the our services page the different services show up so we can click on any of these as they're now in the menu. I don't have any text or anything on these, these are just for the example. And if we click on the R Services page, it shows up as well. So that's how you can add a drop down menu to your WordPress website or blog. I hope you find this video useful, and if you have, please give it a like and feel free to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this one. Once again, my name is Marty from Let's Build WP.com and thank you very much for watching my video.